Uh, I'm back to this way now. Can I kill a chicken? Can I kill this guy? Ever since the war started, my brother had has had malicious thoughts. I'm positive those wretched sorcerers are behind all this. Why did the Emperor call on them to battle the demons? Colonel Dalkin and our soldiers could certainly deal with it by themselves. Hey, they should send the lieutenants too while we're at it. You seem like a nice person. Let's see, any chests? Anything nice? What's up? I know we don't have much money, but Mommy works hard to have enough to take me to see the fights at the Coliseum. My Mommy is super cool! Who's your favorite fighter? I'm so scared of Badass the Exterminator. I get nightmares sometimes, but don't tell my Mommy, okay? She wouldn't want to take me to the Coliseum no more. My son just loves the Coliseum. I wish we were more interested in the hard facts of life, like doing housework, cooking, working to survive. But he'll have time to learn about that when he's all grown up. Better to let him dream for now. You say so, little doll. Let's take a look around real quick. See, gates are closed. I'm guessing that's the inn right there. Oh no, that's not the inn. What is this then? Is this a guild? My mom and dad, they're really, really rich. The kind of makes me a princess, right? I'm going to ask for a pony for my birthday. And also five new dolls. Whenever I start crying, they give me whatever I want anyway. Great, let me get into that chest behind you. Can I get into this chest? A lovely collectible the rush robe. Okay. At times I wonder if being rich is not a kind of servitude. In any case, it brings me many woes. Would I make the same choices if I had to do it all over again? Oh, I would certainly correct my some mistakes. Oh, no doubt be even richer then. Oh, doll girl. Honestly, young man, I find it quite presumptuous of you to speak to me that way. Know that I am destined to inherit my parents' fortune. Therefore, I hardly have time to waste speaking with people of your ilk. Wow. Burn this place to the ground. Why are there so many little girls here? I hate my family. They're snobs who climb the social ladder on the back of big business. All they do is exploit people by stealing their added value of their hearted labor. One day when I grow up, I'll be a revolutionary. Or maybe I'll travel around the world. I haven't really decided yet. Girl, you are sitting here living in the lap of luxury. Even if they even if you hate your parents, you're still taking you're still taking everything they have. Honestly. So You're not really any better. Honestly, Maria, I've told you a hundred times never to comb pink and blue sheets that way. My poor girl, you have no artistic sense about you. This is very upsetting. What in the world do you do all day besides housework? Better yourself, will you? Try immersing yourself in art. Although I doubt you would be receptive to it. Did she just hair flip? Did the bitch just hair flip? The missus is very demanding when it comes to colors. I admit I don't well understand what she wants. Surely it's because I don't know anything about art. Set of bolts. Why on earth do they keep that? Hundreds of plastic toys. What's the point? All you need is one game console. That's true. Some socks. That smells awfully right. Blah. Alright, so... Was there anything in this chest down here, then? 64-piece tea set. Too expensive to use every day. It's brand new. Uh, I'd use it. I fucking love tea. Especially tea sets. If anybody wants to send me tea sets, I'll take those. Be a millionaire. Play and win. Open 10 a.m. to 4 a.m. 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. My chickens ran away, and now they've strayed all across the city. What, you want to help me round them up? Sure. No way. Last time I did that, I trusted a kid all dressed in green who just screwed around. He even used my chickens to fly off the ground. Bunch of nonsense, really. My poor hens were traumatized for weeks. I'll take care of this by myself. Alright, well, fuck you then. You have fun. I wonder what would happen if I actually did help him, though. Like, if I came over here and got this chicken over here. Like, hey, shoot. No, no. I don't have the patience for it. 
W. Oh, hi. My fiance went off to Mayan Bridge to fight those awful demons. I'm so worried about him. What if he comes back disfigured with the scar across his beautiful face? You're an ass. Today's menu. Starter, crunch salad, topped with six leg critters. Main dish, small rat stewed in its own dubious... Dessert, cooked hair pie. Ew. Welcome to Walk Donald's. We haven't started serving food yet. Stop by later. Alright, it looks like we just have to go to the, uh... Actually, let's check this house, too. I'm so proud of my little Dalkin. He has always he's always had such a keen sense of justice. And now he's an important man. I just hope war doesn't change him and that he'll always be my sweet little boy. Ha, ah, good luck with that. War changes everybody. I can't go out the wall. I didn't know that was a wall. Darn it, the sorcerers have requested... Why can I not speak? Requisition the library again. Since they move into the city, it's been barely accessible. I do not wonder what they're search researching it for in there. Regardless, all this time I've been kept from reading the next installment of the Pirate Roberts Adventure Series. That's what they're reading, the Pirate Roberts Adventure Series. Sorcerer. Sorcerer. Old Lady. I don't think our beloved Emperor really wanted to go to war with the demons. After all, he had good relations with them. So why was- why this war? Why now? That's a good question. Ooh, that guy doesn't look nice. Look at that guy. And we're back to the inn. Alright! Time to go into the inn. Unless there's something over here. Oh, there's some houses over here. Look guys, in these type of games, you have to explore. Life is tough as it is, then war has to come and ruin my business opportunities. Anyway, I hope we'll get at least a little damage around these parts. Always good for business damage, mine in particular. <laughs> you do nothing for the cause. You look like a forge, but you don't. It doesn't look like you're really doing anything. Hearts. Welcome to the Genova Orphanage. We take care of all the children who've lost their parents to the war and other disasters. It's a constant commitment, every day and every hour, and unfortunately, every minute too. Redhead girl is very kind. Yes. Yes, ask her. We have great fun to get together. I'm a sweet girl, right? Huh? Yes? What? I can't hear you. Say I'm sweet! Say it! Wait a minute. I'll get you for this. I think I'm gonna have to pee soon. I'm hungry. When do we eat? I'm bored. Wanna play a game? I'm resting for a second. Oh, I do hope they leave me alone. I'm sweet girl, right? Right? Huh? Yes? What? I can't hear you. Say I'm sweet! Say it! No. I did it again. Sucks to be you. Ooh, a shop. That's what I need. Welcome to Raza's. Would you like to buy? Let's buy some tea. Tea? That'll be 25G. Sweet, I got some tea! Buy some weapons. There's a question for the ore. Come back and see us when it's over. Well, that sucks. Let's buy some sugar. And I bet if I try to buy some whiskey... Oh, I can buy some whiskey. That's weird. Ha! Huh. Thanks for two gold back. Alright, to the inn. Hello, doll girl again. Welcome to River Rat Inn. Enjoy our homebrew beer, guaranteed frothless every time. Sample one of our home-cooked meals, fresh from yesterday or even last week. Sleep in our beds with fresh sheets changed less than a month ago. Have a most pleasant stay. After that pitch, I seriously deserve a rage. Yeah, you do. Tell me everything that's wrong with the place. You like to sleep? For you, that'll be 50G for the night. How's that sound? It's your loss. Wait, I said yes, though. What? Welcome in. I can always tell you we're best in town. And I'd even add, honestly still, that you'll remember your stay with us for a long time. 
I doubt that. Why is there a rat in here? There's a rat in here, people. Of course not. Our establishment is the finest cleanliness. <sighs> it must be a stuffed toy left here by a child. That's the most likely explanation, isn't it? Can I talk to the rat? Squeak. Squeak, squeak. Yeah, that's, uh, that's definitely a rat. Your finest establishment. Hello? Are you looking to leave the city? I should be able to arrange that for you. Got some chicken feed for me? You know, clams, moolah, something to smother our relationships. Not that I don't trust you, but a little collateral never hurts. Kuro, I don't like the looks of this guy. I don't think it's such a great idea to deal with him. The young lady is correct, at least in theory. However, I fear we have no other choice. In the army, we often say that the ends justify the means. I think the adage, uh, the adage, applies in the present circumstances. But I shall leave the strategizing to you, Mega Clink. Yeah, no, this guy seems wicked. No. Well, anyway, there's no rush. I don't trust that guy. I don't trust him. Oh! <laughs> you wish to bring something in or out of the city? <laughs> With reduced transit charges, of course. <laughs> Ask Mr. Mundell, he's in the inner courtyard. <laughs> Beer here has a taste you never forget. And I don't mean that in a good way. Dados. Alright, bunch of uh, dudes saying stuff. Hey, asshole! For you, that'd be 50G. How's that sound? Yes! It's your loss. What are you talking about? I'm saying. He says the same thing each time! What is he, an old bat that can't hear anything? Get down here, Nobert. Don't try and tell me you're drunk. The alcohol in this beer evaporated years ago. I'm telling you, I saw them! There were these strange shapes swirling around me, trying to get inside me. Right as I, right as I was going by the sorcerer's headquarters. Well, I was right not to... I was right next to you, and I didn't see a thing. Maybe it was the mushroom dish you had. I did warn you not to eat anything here. Every night I have the same dream. A young woman dressed in black and white in a gothic style made outfit comes to speak to me. And then I wake up. I would give my most treasured possession for a moment with her in real life. Oh well, another drink in keeper. Alright, I guess this is the only thing to do. This whole dealy again. Ah, I think you and me are just gonna get along just fine. How about a small deposit in the facility of relations? Let's say around 450 to start off. No. I don't have what? I do is a cheap ripoff. Not a cheap ripoff, just a ripoff. I have no idea what I'm talking about anymore. Alright, there's gotta be something else we can do. Instead of going to that guy. You. Alright. Alright, let's go up here. Do you know Professor Giro? He's the greatest inventor in the Empire has ever known. Rumor has it his top secret lab is somewhere in the mountains. Dun dun dun. Are you serious? Do I really have to pay him 450G? Can I go to the shop and sell things? Because I have a lot of things to sell. No, I can't. Alright, well, I'm just getting money out of this place. That's cool. I mean, there's that rich place. Maybe I can go there and see if any of the girls want to come. And then, like, I don't know. Hey, I'm you, traveling one. I'm leaving town. You want to come? No. Alright, you're a bitch.
Ah, uh, this whole family is like a horrible, horrible... Oh, hold on, let's talk to the dad again. Oh, uh, no, that's the same thing. How to spend your money when you have too much. I, I don't got anything but to go to that guy and give him 450 G. Which is all of my saved G's. Alright. Four hundred and sixty now? Don't get your panties in bunch, you've earned my trust now. So here's the deal. Oh you asshole! Bring me 150 more and I'll get you out of here. Oh, you can always refuse, of course. But in that case, I'll keep your deposit. It's only natural. I'm guessing you'll accept. I suppose you don't have or no longer have the money on you. Am I mistaken? If you want to leave, it looks like you'll have to work for it. I know, that ugly world. Personally, I try as often as possible to refrain from it. But at times, the ends justify the means. My assistant at the inn should be able to help you find a few odd jobs. In return, you'll have to sleep there. I know, I know, it's no five-star accommodation. But just think of tomorrow when you'll be free and far from the Empire. Good luck. Kuro, are you sure that was a good idea? So, let me get this straight. He just took all of our money no matter what? Like, he just saw how much was in our wallet and took it? What an asshole! That was all my money I saved. Good thing I went and bought that whiskey, tea, and sugar. That's a bit hard, ba harsh badass. Although, Kuro did fall for it hook, line, and sinker. But he's trying his best, and that's what really matters. We have lost all of our money, and what's more, we shall have to pay our way out of the city. First of all, that was our... that was not... That was our money, not yours. And secondly, you don't have to worry because it'll... S I'll see to it that we get out of this horribly... Horrible place. I... Ugh. Is that okay with you, Kira? After all, badass and you are on the lam. Let me make myself useful and earn the money we need. Thanks for trusting me. Okay, let's get to work. Oh, I'm playing as her now? And she... Just punches things. Alright. You're here on behalf of Mr. Mudwell? What can I do for you, miss? I'm looking to do some work in order to pay Mr. Mudwell. Some work? Hmm, let's see. Here's the list of available positions. Let me know what jumps out at you. Made it done. Child care. Let's do the maid job. Are you sure you want to accept the maid at Delamere residence? Awaits you in her mansion. Just remember, keep your cool. I'm not sure I'm going to like this. Look. They're the richest people in town, so that sounds like the best idea. Everything else sounded horrible. I do not want to work at McDonald's. Or at Wickdonald's, or whatever the fuck they call it. Alright, where's the lady? You? Oh, there you are! Finally! You've barely begun and already you're behind on your work. And what in heaven's is... What in heaven's name is that you're wearing? A flagrant abuse of aesthetic sense. Start by putting this on. Uh, ah! What? What the heck is this getup? Don't you dare speak to me with that tone. You accepted the position, didn't you? Then do as you're told. It's your uniform. If it's not to your liking, you know where the door is. I see that you've come to your senses. Now go serve my hu dear husband his tea. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Cause that guy said he saw... Hold on. This guy right here. But! That outfit! The sumptuous embroidery on the black velvet! It's you! My angel! Oh, how I've longed to see you! In vain, I've searched for you at the bottom of every bottle and every tavern around. And now my efforts have finally paid off. Here, a gift I've held on to for a long time. For you! Ew. Oh well, another drinking keeper. 
What the? <laughs> he gave me candy that was already licked? That doesn't seem like anything I wanted. Hey guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and also check out my other videos like my Sword Coast Legends playthrough. Really enjoying that so far, having a lot of fun, going doing a lot of RP. It's been great. And if you're new to this series, also check out the past videos of Evo Land 2. Believe me guys, you're missing a lot if you're starting with this one. Thanks again for watching guys, I really appreciate it, trying to get this channel big, just for my own amusement pretty much. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time.